I moved to Rome planning to stay for a year. More than seven years later, it is hard to imagine ever leaving. What draws me to Rome is its layers. Between the century-old apartments and burnt terracotta walls, there is a vibrancy and espresso-fueled energy that brings something different every day. The ancient cobbled streets of Trastevere are the doorstep to modern cafes and contemporary art galleries, a combination of old and new and constant reinvention that makes the eternal city. Every morning, markets erupt with life across Rome, as locals flock to find the perfect ingredients for their meals. When I first came to Rome, I was overwhelmed by all the new foods, a whole new set of flavors I could explore. There's a certain herb that you can only find here, Roman mint. It has its own scent and flavor that you have to experience to understand. It embodies the spirit of Rome itself, a mix of so many different flavors that creates a single, unique taste. Artists have expressed themselves on Rome's walls for millennia, and that same passion exists today. I was amazed when I first saw the street art in Tor Marancha, part of a project by international artists to brighten this part of the city. Seeing them reminds me that this is a modern capital, full of innovation and ambition, coexisting with its ancient past. The city inspires me, offering something around every corner. In the summer nights, the city comes alive, as music concerts and outdoor cinemas pop up in piazzas across Rome. Dance music echoes through the ruins, an experience that can only be had here. I moved to Rome to study food and culture, but I stayed because of the people. Rome is the city where I met my husband. It is the city where our son was born. There's a reason they call it the eternal city. I could live here forever. This is my room. Come find yours. <laughs>